name is Jeannie Burlesworth. I live here in Little Rock. I'm chair of Secure Arkansas. And I address this council tonight because I have concerns about ICLE, which is a local or international council for local environmental initiatives that Mayor Hayes, you were president of the board of directors of the whole USA, given that it's UN Agenda 21, and I don't think a lot of the citizens quite understand exactly what that means. So let's define sustainable development. Um, it's, it's implementing the global political economic program referred to as sustainable development. Most citizens do not understand the integrated policy and philosophy of sustainable development. It is an action plan being used all across this nation and world to implement the United Nations Agenda 21 program. The movement's roots are much older. It goes back to the 1992 Earth Summit held in Rio de Janeiro, publicly launched the global movement known as Agenda 21. And I want to quote the Secretary General's Earth Summit conference, Maurice Strong, when he addressed the gathering there, he said, quote, current lifestyles and consumption patterns of the affluent middle class involving high meat intake, use of fossil fuels, appliances, home and work air conditioning, and suburban housing are not sustainable. So what we have is a step-by-step -step abolition of private property, primarily through the implementation of the wildland projects and smart growth. We have education of youth to prepare them to be good global citizens, and we have control of the human population. So this concerns me because I see walkable communities, mass transit, rails, trails, and buses, centralized control over water, and forcing people into smart growth projects like you have here tonight. Smart growth and the wildland projects are ultimately designed to abolish private property. So we see the undermining of individuals' in unalienable rights and the undermining of the political boundaries necessary for the constitutional administration of government. Regardless of whether you have cap and trade, global warming, population control, gun control, open borders, illegal immigration, higher taxes, higher gas prices, refusal to drill, education restructuring, international IDs, food control, control of private property, and the UN global government, this is all part of the blueprint. And let this council take note that citizens are watching and citizens are very concerned about this. We appreciate it. We follow the law and honor the Constitution. Thank you very much.